Hey, wanna hang out with us? We're not gonna do anything bad or nothing like that. Hmm, what to do? I really wanna dropkick him. <sighs> Punks like these don't scare me at all, but... Today I'm gonna teach you how to deal with someone with a knife. It'll be annoying if I cause a scene, so I'll just peacefully... Hey! Don't you think ignoring me is a bit much? Shit. I acted on reflex. Hey, now. We best teach this little lady some manners. I've got no choice since it's come to this. Hey. <laughs> what are you doing with my daughter? Were you following me the whole time? I think that's a bit overprotective. I was just going to get some groceries. Uh, no, it's just... I just happened to see you on my way to work, so... But thank you. I can always count on Papa to be my hero. <clears throat> we both agreed that I would call you Papa in public. Get used to it already. Just sit still and open your mouth. And drop it. I can at least eat on my own. This injury isn't that bad anyways. There is no way that's true. You were asleep for several days straight. I was really worried. It was good that I found you just in the nick of time. I really thought you were going to die back there. My bad. I screwed up. I meant... To stay by your side for a little while longer, but... You can't leave me all alone. It's alright. You can keep on living even if you're alone. You're the daughter I'm so proud of, after all. Instead of saying that when you were near death, you can just be honest and say that about me on a regular basis, you know? <clears throat> just kill me already. There is no way I would let you die that easily. I'm still very mad at you. Because you planned to leave me all by myself. My bad. Well, in any case... For now, you need to sit still and let me take care of you. I want you to get better soon. Because I'm proud to have Papa. <laughs>